sitting comfortably, here's everything you need to know about setting up your Embody Gaming Chair. The Embody Gaming Chair is the first high performance gaming chair for gamers. And in this video, we'll be showing you how to set it up in a way that not only improves your gaming sessions, but your health and well-being too. And we'll be getting insight from Herman Miller's John Campbell on why the correct setup for your body is so important. If you want to know more about the Embody Gaming Chair, there's a link in the description. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell if you're new to the channel. Yeah, my name is John Campbell. I work at Herman Miller. I am our gaming lead here. When someone's thinking about their chair setup, they really should be thinking about their entire body and bringing their entire body to the game. Starting with things like the seat height to get your feet flat on the floor. To lower the seat, angle the joystick fully. You're looking for a 90 degree angle between your thighs and your calves with your feet flat on the floor. And the way that you're gonna do this is actually adjust your seat uh, height to ensure that the, the angle between your quads and your calves is a perfect 90 degree angle. You don't want that to be too great because if it is, then it's gonna put pressure in the back part of your leg and it will also uh, raise your feet up off the floor, which removes the anchor point and you lose your leverage. To change the depth of your seat, grab the handles on the side and lift your toes up to take the weight off your thighs. Then just pull it forward or backwards. Always make sure there's clearance between the back of the knees and the front of the chair. If you're not entirely sure, err on the short side to avoid pressure on the underside of the thighs or the back of the calves. Other things that you're gonna be looking for is about getting your head in the right position. So if your back's not properly supporting your spine and your head's out of alignment, it's gonna force you to push your head down in order to look at the middle of the screen, which is where you need to look. So making sure that your head is properly aligned by adjusting the back of your chair. The specific adjustment on the body gaming chair is called back fit. You can actually get your head to the proper place so that you don't have to force your head down and your eyes can be in the right uh, uh, sight line to keep your body properly aligned. Back fit is critical. Twist your back fit adjuster clockwise fully forward. Then lean back into your chair, twist it anti-clockwise until your eyes are in line with your computer screen. Making sure that the back actually fits your unique spinal curvature and puts your head in the right position, really important there to make sure that your eyes are then aligned to your screen in the right way. To change the back tilt tension, just twist the tilt limiter. When the chair is putting you in proper alignment, what should happen, the feeling that you should get is the chair should just simply disappear. You shouldn't feel it, you should feel like you're floating and really focusing 100% on the thing that you're doing. Make sure that your arms are properly adjusted based on your unique uh, needs. Press the buttons underneath to raise and lower your arm pads. Arms should rest comfortably without any lift from your shoulders. When you're thinking about gaming performance and proper body alignment, the thing that we're focused on is called the anatomical loop, which is about putting your body in the proper position in the proper alignment so that you're giving yourself additional leverage and strength that is gonna be needed in order to make the moves that you're trying to make or in order to stay focused so that you can capture all that data and make really, really tough decisions right in the heat of things. To adjust width, place two hands on an arm pad and simply push out and pull in. Elbows should be in line with your shoulders. One piece of advice that I'd give you is always thinking about changing your posture as you're especially sitting for a really long period of time. So yes, the chair is gonna be properly aligned to you and supporting you in the right way, but in between a scrim or a match, stand up for a couple minutes. Hit the recline mechanism or recline backwards. This takes pressure off your spine, gives you a little bit of relaxation so that you're able to jump back in it and perform at that elite level again. You can engage. Or disengage tilt using the Tilt Limiter Lock. So, that's everything you need to know about setting up your Embody Gaming Chair. Thanks to John Campbell for joining us and hit the link in the description if you fancy taking the next steps to your ideal gaming setup. Let us know in the comments what you love about the Embody Gaming Chair and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.